met some people, mm-hmm. which is great. Um, met an um, 88 or 92 year old lady um, who's like wrestling with Christianity. Mm-hmm. So she she believes in Jesus, but she also wants to believe in other gods as well. So she just okay. wants to believe as hedging her bets. Yeah. So, okay, yeah. And then with the Pentecostal church, we I um, I just went to church with them mm-hmm. on Saturday and Sunday. Yeah. Um, they have like different services at different times, mm-hmm. and did that. So, so you attended all the all the services. All their services, yeah. In different yeah. languages. Mm-hmm. And then I had a translator by my side. It was um, a little different because they spoke in tongues and. Mm-hmm. Um, they prophesize over people, so I've never done that. But then, that the did they, yeah, apparently, did they interpret the the, the prophecy? The tongues? Yeah. The tongues? Yeah, you have to interpret the tongues. See, Paul says to simply, you know, speaking in tongues is fine, but it's useless unless there is interpretation. But did they speak in tongues in prayers or in, in prayers. preaching? Not in preaching, I think. Only um, in prayers, right? Yeah, in prayers. Yeah. I've never like come across that before, so it was very different. Um, and they all prayed very loud. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and they all prayed together. Mm-hmm. I've heard heard of that type of prayer called I forget the name of it. When everyone prays together and loud. We did that. Yeah, we did that. We did that at uh, Stephen's church. Mm-hmm. We did just like we did at the Bible the Bible, Bible study. study. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. It, it's pretty common. But not, but not necessarily in tongues. And it's not necessarily in tongues. <laughs> Other, otherwise, I mean, but you're not going to understand. It's me, it's me. It's me. <laughs> it's not a mouse. Yeah. 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 But, yeah. And we also walked like down this way, and there's like a group of older people that we met um, who like hang out there, mm-hmm. and they're trying to. Uh, form them into a simple church because uh, what they're doing um, with the YWAM is they're trying to get people together uh, so like the working class because they're all like intermingled and um, it's like a big network that if they can get one person uh, to become a Christian mm-hmm. uh, that they can uh, make those connections with everyone else mm-hmm. so there's this group of older people um, out here by the just on the there stretch here, yeah, mm-hmm. on the river that just uh, look over all day long, and uh, they've been making those connections with them and talking with them. And, Interesting. Mm-hmm. Which it's it's been. They said that we help them a lot because like American Christians coming, so that way they can see different faces mm-hmm. to this. So, uh, but we we help them a little bit um, compared to you know what their overall picture is. So. Mm-hmm. 